Hi art friends! Hello art friends! Korean seaweed. Can you paint with it? <laughs> Today we are going to be drawing mermaids and hopefully colouring them with Changa Grilled Seaweed Snack. Fresh and clean tasty lava. Just for the record guys, I don't think this is going to work, but he is really convinced that this it will. This was roasted quickly on a 300 degrees grill. It's got to do something. You think it'll do something? It'll do something. Whether it'll be super pigmented, I don't know, but it'll do something. Okay. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> do you have any idea how much ocean I had to go through to get all this seaweed? <laughs> Thank you for the watercolour paper. You're very welcome. <laughs> We're using cast art paper today, guys, if you're not too sure. It's the one that we use quite a lot in these videos. It's pretty good. Oh, we're both colour coordinated today. I also, I've got toothpaste on me, but try to ignore that. Uh, I see you decided to get half dressed again. <laughs> yeah, today. it's so cold. So I thought, you know what, I'll put on my fuzzy PJ bottoms. And then I saw my dressing gown. I was like, you know what, if I just snuggle up to this, <laughs> it's like I'm practically dressed with bed, but I'm still half dressed. <laughs> <laughs> just film me from the waist up. <laughs> It'll be fine. Do you have any idea what kind of mermaid you want to do? That's not good enough. I'll try and make it a seaweed mermaid. Good, that's better. Don't forget to join in, guys, if you draw a mermaid too. You don't have to use seaweed, but you'll get like, I don't know, a dream, including Monty, if you do. And this big thumbs up from me. Anyone who's not using seaweed in their picture, close your eyes, this isn't for you. <laughs> Shame! <laughs> <laughs> I'm off to a great start. Okay. I thought, you know what, I need a reference image, so I googled mermaid photo, and then I was like, wait, they're not real. <laughs> <laughs> Who's your fuzzy friend over there? <gasps> I'm so glad you asked. This is my new friend that I picked up. He's giving me a lot of side eye. So when we were paying at the till in Tiger, I saw him, like, sat on the window display. <laughs> he was shiftily looking at you like that. I basically had to dismantle the entire window display to quickly get hold of this and then <laughs> throw it in the basket in time for Adam to pay for it. Because I want him! <laughs> and guess what I've named him? Tell me. He's called Mr. Fuzzy Tummy, and it's because his tummy's so fuzzy. He's got Velcro so he can take it off and all. Oh, I love him so much. I don't know if he's a bear or if he's a hamster. I, I think he had a beaver friend in the shop, so I'm pretty sure he's not. He a separated him from his only friend. Oh, you're making me want to go on. No one is giving you a side. I am so lonely. I swear in one of these next videos, we'll just have an entire cast of superhero <laughs> animals behind him. Yes! I'm gonna slowly go back and get every <laughs> single one. Okay guys, here's a quick little sketcheroo that oh, I feel like I'm gonna be working with. I haven't even looked with. at yours, let me see. Ooh. How are you doing? I'm going for something cute. It's like a mermaid sat on a rock. I like a hairstyle, how it's covering one eye. That was like literally the only part of the vision that I had. I was like, oh I'll have a mermaid <laughs> that's kind of like this. Beautiful. Does he, do you think Walrus looks cute with his glasses on? Yeah, I think so. It, it sort of magnifies his eyes and gives him that kind of anime look. <laughs> and a lot of you guys say, where's Monty and Freddy? Monty's there and Freddy's been wedged between Monty's ears for like, I don't know, three months? Yeah, but he's still got his paintbrush as well. I've like forgotten how to hold a pen. It feels really weird. <laughs> what? Weren't you literally just using one yesterday? <laughs> no, it's all different now. Ooh. This fine liner is just that. It is mighty fine. Oh, is that the really skinny tipped one? Yeah, yeah, the 0.05 this is. It's an art line one, apparently. Do they actually make fine liners thinner than that one, or is that like the thinnest I, I fine do, liner ever? I do think this is the thinnest one, yeah. But guys, let us know if you know of any thinner ones than, yeah, the 0.05. Yeah, me know. it's like a Guinness world record for thinnest fine liner. <laughs> Are we getting a bit too niche here? <laughs> no one's got time to make that. There we go. And she's got gills because she needs to breathe underwater, you know. What do you think mermaids eat? <laughs> I was about to say other mermaids, but probably not. <laughs> they're cannibals! <laughs> That's why you don't see any of them because they're too busy eating each other. I don't know, maybe they just eat like plankton. <laughs> Plankton! You mean, like whales, they just swim around with their mouths <laughs> open. <laughs> what about crabs? No, they'd be friends with crabs. Haven't you ever watched The Little Mermaid? I think she was just tagging him along so she could eat him. <laughs> when he starts sinking under the sea, she just starts getting him, getting him ready. You look so good with butter on, mm. I thought he was a lobster, wasn't he? Or was he a crab? It, oh, wow, I, I think he was a crab. Because lobsters have tails and I don't think he did. Lobsters have tails? 
Of course lobsters have tails. Like a shell tail. Yeah, it's like a little it's like a little paddle and they can use it to swim and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, I think Steph might need a minute to Google what a lobster looks like. <laughs> do you even, you do know what a lobster is, right? Like a dog tail. No, it's not like a dog tail. Are you sure it's called a tail? Yeah. You, you know what? <laughs> uh, yeah, we're gonna do this now on camera. Hold on two seconds. Okay. This is very important, guys. We interrupt your viewing to bring you lobster tails. There is literally restaurants called Lobster Tail. Now, bear in mind it's cooked and it's no longer attached to said lobster. But that is a lobster tail. And as its little paddle on the end to help it swim around, that is a lobster tail. Isn't that just like a big treat to look like? <laughs> This is undeniable proof that lobsters have tails. He is not just pleased to see you, that is his tail! Wait a minute. That's his tail! It kind of looks like a shell. Guys, comment down below. Do lobsters have tails? <laughs> <laughs> I have given you my argument. What did you think? Yeah. Okay, let me show you <laughs> my drawing. <laughs> show me your drawing. What have you got? Oh, that's looking really oh. cute. I really like the uh, the little swirls that you've done on the rocks. They're really cute. The swirly rocks. You draw such cute things, hun. What's her name? Oh, I was about to say Marmella, but we already have a Marmella. What about Salty Samantha? <laughs> okay, that'll do. Excellent. <laughs> Send in your fan art of Salty Samantha now. I'm a razor, man. Ah! Because I'm ready. I'm, I'm, I'm convinced. I think it'll work, so. <laughs> Give me a chance to couch up, will ya? Couch up? <laughs> Give me up. a chance to couch up. I've come for a sneaky peek at your lining. Oh. I really hope it does work, because I think the sepia pen's gonna go really nice with like, I'm hoping the green pigment that comes out of the seaweed. <laughs> yeah, I haven't really thought about the colour palette of what this is gonna look like whatsoever. It's gonna be green. Well, you're presuming it's gonna go green. What if like absolutely no pigment comes out? Or it goes purple or something. I really, really hope it works because the artwork that you've done is really cute and it'd yeah, be I really shame. like the story. The story better not get ruined. <laughs> well, I'm rooting for you. <laughs> rooting and tooting for me. Yeah, I'm sat on this bed ripping a fart and hoping this works. Oh, wow. Because I'm so nervous. I gave her like a little Lisa Simpson pearl necklace. Oh, it could be made of actual pearls, right? I think it's from Lisa Simpson. It could, be. it could be made from Lisa Simpson. She went too deep into the ocean. I bet that's the face she made when she killed Lisa Simpson. Yeah, maybe she ate her. Okay, you, yeah, are we all lying now? Right, no pressure or anything. I'm kind of happy with how this has come out. <laughs> and I'm really hoping that the seaweed is really well pigmented because I've thought of a really cute idea of how I could be colouring this right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's a really cute picture. I really hope it works. Don't look at me like that. Fingers crossed, guys. <laughs> or you'll never see Adam again. <laughs> the time has come. Ooh. We actually really like eating this, like, anyway. Yeah, I'm kind of <laughs> tempted to eat this. <laughs> no! It smells like the ocean. So where did you get this idea from? What made you want to try and paint with this? Well, I was thinking about seaweed, as you do. And I was like, oh, mermaids live in the sea. I wonder if I could paint a mermaid with seaweed. This is really oily. <laughs> <Done. laughs> oh, and I'm going to be putting it on my drawing that I like. This could be, this could actually be... I don't want it to be, but this could be the worst one we've ever done. No, don't say that. The stakes are high. I'm not feeling confident about this one. No, now, you now are. I'm, now I'm feeling the consistency of it. I'm like, hmm. That's why I had no idea what you wanted to do. Hmm. Maybe if we'd went into like the sea and got some like moist seaweed. <laughs> I'm not farming my own seaweed <laughs> in the ocean. Um, I better get some tissue in case this goes horribly wrong. So be right back. <laughs> I got that on camera. <laughs> Actually, I might eat some while I'm, <laughs> while I'm waiting. Nice. <laughs> We're eating our arms <laughs> What are you doing? I suppose you want me to go first. Yep, this is the thing that we were talking about in the live stream that Adam had a genius idea that I didn't think was going to work. This, this is it. Let's <laughs> find out if it works. I'm just pondering my life choices. <laughs> Let's try and go with this bit here first. I'm gonna take a piece and put it in there. Okay. Hold it. <laughs> wow. So far, so good. <laughs> Come on, you can do this. 
Okay. <laughs> Let's move on to this. I'll try and do the eyes first. Will it pigment? Let's get some water in there. I can see something. Can you guys see anything? I can see green. It doesn't help that you're putting it on the tiniest bit of detail. You're going to have to cover a bit more ground, I think. Okay. I can see green. I can see green. Guys, poll time. Is there green there? I can see it. I can see the green. <laughs> Is there something there? <laughs> Honey, I'm colorblind and I can see that. I feel like I've got like a more and pastel going on right now. Yeah, that's essentially what you're doing with your paintbrush. Crafting with my water brush. <laughs> see, look, pigment! Pigment! Uh, okay, well, let's see if it goes on the paper. Okay. What do you want me to do? Try and do the hair? Like a larger area? I just area? want you to impress me, to be honest. <laughs> oh my god, I think it's a bit late for that. <laughs> I can see it! I can see it! I'm. N well, I, I hope I'm not hallucinating. <laughs> I can. I can see it! Currently, I think we're on the same sort of level as the grape juice one that <laughs> yeah. we did, but I, I can see it. It needs like a lot of water, but it's working. Oh, it's getting stuck to my fingers. I wonder if you can just like wet a piece and then smear it on. <laughs> okay, we can try that. Yeah. This bit's pretty wet, so... Oh wow, it actually, <laughs> it actually works way better. Look at that. You're getting some cool texture. <laughs> You cannot deny that there is colour in this now. I kind of like the the flakes of <laughs> seaweed. I think it looks pretty cool because she's a seaweed mermaid. Well, if you wanted to add flakes to your designs, if you considered seaweed or fish food, can you paint with fish food? That's probably going to be what Adam does yes! next. Oh my god, yeah! <laughs> yes, I, I could draw Pot Jackson with seafood! Guys, <laughs> thumbs up the video if you want to watch me draw Pot Jackson with seafood. That's such a cool idea. Oh my god, yes. I was saying it ironically, but I should have known that you would have thought that's a good idea. Pot Jackson! He deserves a video of his own. Okay, I'm gonna leave you to get on with that for a bit. I'm gonna eat some seaweed, not this stuff. The stuff that's in here. <laughs> that bit's good, it's got added watercolour in it. <laughs> it smells like low tide in here. Yeah, I was about to say, because of all the wet seaweed, it does actually smell a bit like a beach. <laughs> trying to soak. Own the it? medium. Make Own it, the medium. <laughs> make it work for you. Oh, wow, that feels interesting. Does it feel like a moist beach? What are you doing? I have no idea. I can't believe I'm doing this to a drawing that I like. There At least go. it looks like she's got fish scales. That's what I mean, yeah. It's a pretty cool effect, actually. I mean, I wouldn't really advise doing this one at home, because <laughs> it's kind of smelly, but it makes a cool effect, right? Look at that. That does look like fish scales. It's going to look cool when it's, like, finished, but then it won't look cool for very long, because I think it might go mouldy. <laughs> yeah, this one, this is definitely the stinkiest one that we've ever done. And I'm judging that the smellier it is, the mouldier it's going to be. <laughs> yeah. The series should turn into, will it mould? <laughs> <laughs> will it mould? Tune in in three months time. Wow, our bedroom is smelling interesting right now. <laughs> smells like the seventh sea. Seriously though, right? Doing this makes the pigment so much stronger. I'm like, why didn't I do this before? <laughs> it creates such a weird smell when you do that. <laughs> it's like burning seaweed. <laughs> you know, this video at this point could literally be called Drawing Smelly Mermaids. <laughs> She's a bit stinky. I think, I, think, I think this one's died. Look at that, you can't deny that there is pigment there, right? Yeah, it's making some green colouring. I'm proud of myself. This was another That's great idea. What mine looks like. At least it's got a lot of uh, Yours texture. looks really cute. Yeah, the, the uh, tail especially is looking so cute on yours. You've really stuck through this video for me. Yep, that's what true love is. <laughs> when, when your man asks you to paint with seaweed, love says yes, I'll do it. <laughs> it's stressing me out so much, the smell. <laughs> it smells so bad. YouTube, where's that smell of vision? We you need it now. No, you guys don't need this. <laughs> I don't need this in my life. I like eating seaweed as well. I don't normally have a problem <laughs> with this anymore. Anymore. <laughs> We'll be painting with all of our seaweed from now on in this house. <laughs> oh, who even needs a water brush? This is great. <laughs> all you need is a piece of paper, some water and some seaweed and you can create a beautiful collage like me. <laughs> collage? <laughs> Look, it leaves like little flake effects. <laughs> it, this is awesome. This is like the best thing we've done in ages. Well, apart from the huge pencil, but Rome wasn't built in a day. 
you know, I'm starting to notice this thing that every idea that you come up with is always the best idea we've had in ages. Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. I'm glad you agree. Remove, Picking up the chunks. Remove chunk. the debris. <laughs> Okay guys, here's what we managed to create with Seaweed. I think this was a huge success. And if you made it to the end of this incredible video, be sure to comment down below with I am a salty sea dog. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna post a mystery video somewhere on screen now and don't forget to like and subscribe so we can see you next time for another Doodle, Doodle Date. Bye for now guys. Bye. Bye bye.